give me five, give me that which I desire. Ooh. Welcome back, Wildcats, and welcome to today's edition of Wildcat News. Today is Monday, October 28th, and all this week, we will be featuring Red Ribbon Week facts. That's all coming right up, but first, please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. This week is Red Ribbon Week, and the theme for this year is Life is a Movie, Film, Drug Free. Red Ribbon Week takes place October 23rd to 31st every year, and every day this week we will be reading facts about drugs, drug use, and prevention. We are also asking you to help us show that Wildcats want to live drug-free. Show your support by signing a Red Ribbon Pledge located in the counseling office. There has been a 121% increase in the suspected overdose deaths in 2010. The largest increase in drug use and misuse occurred during COVID. The CDC is estimating that the amount of deaths from overdose poisoning in our country over a 12-month period to be around 107,477, which is enough to fill Lincoln Financial Field, including the Eagles locker room, staff, the opposing team, their staff, as well as the main parking lots used for tailgating. Attention junior high students, if you're interested in applying for student government, your applications are due by the end of the day today. See Ms. Betts or Ms. James for more information. Time now to turn it over to Kayla and Melvin to find out what's on our lunch menu today. Today for lunch, we have chicken and waffles or spicy mozzarella bites. Next, Melvin. Dímelo, mi gente. Hoy por almuerzo tenemos pollo con gofres y bocados de mozzarella. Regresamos al estudio. Thanks, Kayla and Melvin. If you are interested in helping to make a positive change in our school, you should join the Student Equity Club. Their first meeting is on Tuesday after school in room E14. Scan the QR code and complete the Google form to sign up. The Junior High Art Club will, be ha will have an extra October session next Tuesday, the 29th. The first November session will be after November break on November 12th. And Make Up Picture Day is this Wednesday, October 30th. What's happening with our fall sports teams today? Let's go to Gianni for the details. Junior High Cross Country has a meet at 3.45 p.m. Boys JV Soccer has a JV game at 3.45 p.m. JV Football has a game at 4 p.m. Back to you guys at the studio. Thanks, Gianni. Time now for today's segment. In, in the spirit of Halloween coming up later this week, our reporters want to know what you were going to be for Halloween. Let's take a look. Hi, I'm here with William. What do you want to be for Halloween? A ghost type. Hi, I'm here with Miss McKinley. What do you want to be for Halloween? I want to be a Powerpuff Girl. Specifically, I want to be Bubbles. Yes. <laughs> I'm here with Mr. Weiner. What do you want to be for Halloween? Stone Cold Steve Austin. <laughs> okay, ready? What do you want to be for Halloween? Um, me and my boyfriend wanted to be Mario and Peach. A serial killer. I want to be a minion. <laughs> um, I'm gonna be the Fortnite character. <laughs> um, I'm going to be uh, Art the Clown, Ooh, uh, the Fortnite character. Who am I here with? Liz. What do you want to be for Halloween? Um, the Subway surf Surfer Girl. Nice. Finally, we'd like to wish a very happy birthday to... Michaela Richards. Well, that's all for us today. Be sure to subscribe to us on YouTube at MS Wildcats TV. From all of us in the new TV studio, thank you for watching and have a magical, magical moment. <laughs>